Hey guys, thanks for watching this video. And in this game, I'm actually gonna play two uh, games. The second one, it's not gonna take real long. Not much happens in it, but some stuff happens. It's just kind of funny, so I just kind of wanna uh, put it up. It's really just the end of the game. But anyway, um, right now it's Winterfest, and so th th there's the Winterfest challenges, and I'm actually playing solo squads. Both games is uh, solo squads. And I'm doing it just because it's a lot easier to get a lot of challenges done. Uh, at least I find uh, playing squads, but just doing it solo, like trying to outlast opponents and all that. So that's the main reason that I'm doing it. It's also the Star Wars challenges are going on right now. So that's what I'm doing as well. I'm trying to get the uh, TIE Fighter and all that crap, all those challenges. But anyway, so that's what basically is going on uh, in this game. And this game in particular is really just a good example of the way that I play being super sneaky, being quiet. You know, I see that pretty much in all my videos. That's how I have fun. And uh, just trying to go for the win, just trying to just play as sneaky as I can and just to kind of see how the game just, you know, unfolds for me. Um, so in this game, you know, I've dropped over here. There's a squad that's over here. There's a squad that's right over here. And I was going up this way because I was trying to get up here to uh, the TIE Fighter. And um, I end up getting down the troops and whatnot and then get the, you know, part of the challenge done. Um, so anyway, we're going to go ahead and kind of fast forward because not much happens really here. Just kind of focus on the end of the game because all this really happens is I go up here, I get the challenge, you know, take out the troops, and then we end up moving north. And the game basically ends here at Frenzy Farm, so we'll get to it. All right, so right now we've got this guy coming up. This guy is getting, uh, this is Lot of Rock, I believe it's his name. Yeah, or Lot of Rock 436. So he's taking some shots. Um, his teammates are basically over on this side. Try not to say basically so much, but anyway. So his teammates are fighting over here. So this guy is right above me. Now I'm sitting underneath here. Now what I'm doing at this point is I'm not moving. I don't want to make any noise at all because what I know is that he's taking shots at the guys over here. He's taking shots at guys over here. And I know that he's by himself. There's no other, there's no one else coming. No one else is making any noise at all. So now he takes off down here. So let's get it back on me. All right. So now this guy is down on the ground. So I'm looking for him, but I'm trying to move very quietly because I didn't know if he had stopped like next to the building. I didn't want to let, I don't want to alert him that I was here. Then all of a sudden I see him down there in the river. It's like, all right, let's go ahead and just line this guy up. He's not moving. Boom, get the headshot. And so right there, a lot of rock, he ends up going down. So there's a whole lot of chaos that's taking place over on this side. And uh, I don't know who it is, but somebody takes a shot at me here. I I'm, not <laughs> I'm not sure who it is. They come in, yeah, right there. Someone was taking shots. But what I knew was this guy was off by himself. So I turn the corner here. I see the guy on the ground, but it's like... Just leave him alone. I mean, we're at the end of the game. There's no point. I don't need to take this guy down. I don't need to finish him off right there is basically what I'm saying. Because there's no point. So, and the thing you got to remember is I'm, I'm playing solo squads. So, it's, I'm looking for the advantage right now. I'm trying to figure out, you know, where's the best place for me to end up. I'm trying to get to the edge of the corn here so I can look out. So I'm looking across, I'm looking for shots of opportunity. I know that there's no one on my, sort of right behind me or right on my immediate left from where I came from. So I don't have to keep checking back there. So all of a sudden I get up to here and I end up hearing this team come in. SG Creamy comes over by me, a spandex. So we got a squad over here, a squad here, another squad's down here. Here come these guys. So they're doing a good job because they're in the circle. And so Creamy just ends up kind of being in the wrong place at the wrong time. Because he gets right in front of me here, has no idea that I'm here. So get a headshot, get this guy down. Now 
his teammates are over on this side and i had seen where one of his teammates had had taken off running over here the person who's the uh the soccer player so all of a sudden i see the soccer players coming back so i know he's coming to revive them so it's like okay i'll just wait on this in the meantime i see that guy go ahead and get uh get a headshot on him take him down now the guy's getting healed up line up the shot couple headshots with the burst i'm able to get both of them down so now they're gone so you know that's three limbs in at this point and i kind of just keep looking i knew that the last teammate their last teammate was now solo and he was up at the top and i knew that there were still a couple guys who were over on the other side over here Sure as the world, I had seen somebody and had just taken a shot, but I didn't hit them or, or anything. So, now, I, I don't have the player feed up, but it was down to three people at this point. So, I can hear a guy healing up. I'm looking behind me just to make sure it's not one versus one versus one, that it really is, you know, one versus two at this point. So, all of a sudden, I hear these guys, they're right over by me, and they have no clue that I'm here. So... Kind of just wait to see what they're going to do real quick. And I hear them just kind of keep running over. And I knew that they were looting the guys that I had, you know, I had killed. So I just slowly move up, trying not to make any noise. I don't, I don't want them to hear my footsteps. And so right then, all of a sudden, here comes this Joker. I don't want to see what this guy's name was. So it's Silent Wraith and Lakota Jedi. So... These guys get right in front of me, pull out the sniper rifle, line this guy up. So right there, I know, okay, it's basically one versus one at this point, because that guy's not. So now it's just like, okay, it's just, it's shotgun time, let's go. And this guy, I'm not trying to dog the guy, he, he's just, not as experienced, I don't think. Victory Royale get it right there and is this you know it's just a good it's just a good game it's just a it's just a perfect game for me to kind of sit there and say like with my little strategy of just being sneaky looking for moments of opportunity it allows me to get victories like this it's it's i I'm, there's no way i'm playing solo squads and i'm gonna take on one verse four i mean that's just not gonna i'm not good enough to be able to do that but the way that this game unfolded, yeah, it worked. So let's go ahead and just look at the second game here real quick. I love Fortnite. I love the, the silliness. I love everything about this game. It's just fun. But anyway, all right. So in this game right here, um, again, my total goal here is I'm trying to get the challenge done where... I don't even need the stretch goals, but I just like getting them done. I just like doing them. And I'm just trying to outlast opponents playing solo, duo, or squad. So I'm trying to get that challenge accomplished while at the same time I'm, I'm trying to finish up the, uh, the Star Wars challenges, which I did finish actually earlier tonight. But the one challenge that I needed to get done um, that you can't do in Team Rumble is uh, the TIE Fighter where you have to put your banner up at the TIE Fighter. So what I'm doing is I decided like, all right, well, I'm going to head over to Retail Row. And because I didn't think that there would be a lot of people that would be going over there. Uh, at least that was my original thought. Um, and for the most part, that's true. So basically what happens here, and yes, I said basically, um, uh, I'm just heading over in this direction. That's all I'm trying to do is I'm trying to hit right here with the TIE Fighter, and then I'm trying to get over here to this TIE Fighter. So let's go ahead and fast forward. All right, so I get in a retail row. I knew that there were other guys that had kind of dropped here with me. Um, there was a whole four-man squad here. The First Order guys are up here. So I know I've got a squad. And right here, I hear the guy come in with the umbrella. So what I'm doing at the moment is I, I'm just listening to where this guy's going. Because he doesn't know I'm here, obviously. And so, it's like, okay, let's give it a second. Let's see where he is. Then all of a sudden, I know that he's over by the gate. So it's like, alright, well, let's go get this guy. 
takes a shot at me. Do some damage. Get around the corner and get this guy. Picked him up. Not, not, on, not even on purpose. I didn't even mean to do that. I just uh, <laughs> end up doing it. Now, where were, were his teammates? Yeah, his teammates weren't even coming over at this point. They're like, all right, well, he's gone. So they never came over. They weren't doing that. So, all right. So anyway, from here, um, I'm just going to show the first order real quick. I just get these guys down, and then I do the other one, and then we'll get to the end of the game. So this is the challenge. I mean, everyone who's playing for it and already knows. So that's all I'm trying to do right here. I'm just trying to get these, and then I end up falling down the freaking cliff for crying out loud. I, whatever. Anyway, there's only one guy left. See this guy, get him down, and go ahead. And I, the other challenge I was trying to get done was to do damage with the uh, blaster. So go over, get that thing put up, and um, these guys just, you know, that squad never paid any attention to me they would have heard the gunshots but they just never came up so from here all i end up doing is moving up to the next tie fighter crash site all right so all i'm doing now i'm coming up to the second crash site and i do love the sound of the blasters it's half the reason i even wanted to put this in here like i have no intention of going and seeing the new star wars movie i i could care less in fact i kind of hate the star wars movies the, the new trilogy it's just not my cup of tea. If you like it, knock yourself out. Have fun. I just don't like them. I, in fact, I hate them. In fact, I never even got through the, what was it? The Last Jedi? That was the last one. And then this is the Rise of Skywalker is what all this is about. All these challenges. And I can care less. I'm not going to see it. I, I got halfway through... It came to Netflix, and I watched, like, half of The Rise of Sky, or The the Last Jedi, and I just turned it off. I said, I can't do this anymore. Like, I'm done. I'm out. Because I hated the first one, The Force Awakens. Whatever. Anyway, let's just focus on the game and not me ranting about Star Wars. Uh, I don't care about it. But it is fun having the Star Wars stuff in the game, and it's actually a lot of fun. So, And that's why I'm kind of prefacing all this is because they also have the lightsabers and that's important for the end of this game all right so running up here i'm getting into the circle at this point and jumping to a bush here now what ends up happening is i look over to my right over here and i see that there are lightsabers there and it's like i think i'm gonna have to go get one of the lightsabers um i didn't need any more of those challenges um for the lightsaber but it's actually really nice to have just because you can block them, you know, the incoming shot, you know, block the uh, damage. So that's what I decided to do is go over and grab one of those. But if you look at the map here, so it's actually a pretty big circle at this point. And there ends up being a squad that kind of runs up near me, but I don't immediately get into a fight with them at all. And once the circle comes in, um, you know, this squad comes up. There's nobody else who kind of pops up on my right, but there were a lot of people left at this point. Um, in fact, all these guys, I and mean, this is just who's in range, but basically what is that? I mean, that looks like about 18 or so people. So a lot of people left. It's kind of a big circle. You know, everybody's coming in. These two, um, this squad and then this squad ends up getting into a fight. And all I'm doing at this point is just chilling in the bush and I'm gonna go get the lightsaber. So at this point, now all, you know, the circle's getting smaller, everybody's kind of converging, and I've got a lot of advantage at this point. Because remember, the main challenge I'm trying to do here is to outlast my opponents. So I have no problem letting everybody else fight and me just trying to get to the end. Because even at this point, it's not so much caring about winning the game. For me at this point it's just trying to outlast my opponents so there ends up being um we've got one squad and then where's the other guy there's somebody else 
Um, this guy's teammate, I think, is over on the other side. I don't know. I know that there's one other person here. I'm positive that there is. So I haven't built a structure or anything. I'm trying not to give away my position. And I'm really just kind of waiting to see. Because at this point, it was down to, I believe it was down to four people. And um, what I was doing, yeah, there's his buddy just showed up. So it's these two guys, and then there's a guy who's sitting up here, and then he'll pop in uh, here in a second. So basically, it's four people. And I didn't know at this point if it was one versus three, you know, what the deal was. So we're going to go ahead and put it on gameplay here real quick. So we were not down to uh, four people, we're down to five people. So there's actually a two-man squad over here and a two-man squad that is from the north here. So these guys are coming down. I wanted to take a shot at that guy right there. And he moved at the last second. I wanted to take a shot at that guy over there, but he kept moving. And I was at too great of, of a distance. If he was stationary, I mean, I was ready to take the shot. Then I was ready to take the shot right there. But his teammate, you know, he go he gets him down. So now I'm I'm just kind of looking. Now here's the thing. Now it's one versus two. There's we're down to three players. I see that guy. I missed that shot. And I've got a little bit of an advantage here. I'm you know I'm in an elevated position. I don't know how I missed that shot right there. The guy was looking. Ugh. Don't know what happened. But it's like all right whatever let's just go ahead we'll just build a quick structure here see if i can't get some shots off and i kept saying to myself like i've got the lightsaber so you know what i'm gonna end up doing <laughs> and so these guys all of a sudden i see that both of them have lightsabers and so it's like all right you know what let's just have some fun let's just let's have a lightsaber duel and I, I thought that that's what they were going to do i thought that they would just go ahead and kind of come up and and, and rush me and it would be kind of fun. I mean, that's what I thought was going to happen. And it's not really what happened right here. They kind of just kept taking shots at me. <laughs> and I had no mats. Like, right, I just <laughs> put down. That was it. I had no more. And it's like, ah, all right. Let's just use the lightsaber, guys. And they kind of rush me, blocking damage. This guy comes down here. Rolls. Knock him real quick. Now this guy. Do 45 damage to him. Now, I don't blame this guy for what he's doing. He's trying to put down traps. But it's like, if you're not putting me in a structure to put the trap, all I'm going to do is run around it, which is exactly what I did. Do 45, and right there... Get another victory royale on the day, and I <laughs> I probably didn't deserve this one. You know, it's a, it's a three kill, and I had the one, you know, random kill at the beginning. And uh, I'm willing to bet that these two jokers really wish they could have had this game back and approach it a little bit differently than the way that they did. But it sort of is what it is. You know, it was a lot of fun just with the lightsabers. But I, I would have preferred kind of having that lightsaber duel, but didn't really happen but anyway alrighty guys thanks so much for watching uh, I do appreciate anybody who ends up seeing this I just like putting these videos up it's just a lot of fun for me and Fortnite is just a fun game I, it just it, it keeps staying fun you know I, I'll take breaks from it I'll, I'll stream it for a while I'll play it you know um, like when the challenges come out and then I burn myself out on it and then I play something else like, I've been playing a lot of Wrath lately, and it's, um, I love that game. It's a lot of fun, too. So, but at, at the end of the day, Fortnite just continuously, they keep doing new things. It's a ton of fun. So, as long as they keep making it fun, I'm going to keep playing, and I'm going to keep putting up videos just because I enjoy doing it. So, if you enjoy it, too, thanks so much. I do appreciate you seeing it. And uh, if you're not watching this, I don't blame you either. All right. Thanks so much, guys. I will catch you next time.